hey this is Ron. Um, right now I'm going to review my PlayStation I that I'm doing the video on. Um, 7.16 p.m. Eastern Standard Time that is um, November 3rd 2008. Uh, this is currently hooked up to my PS3 via USB. Uh, my first complaint about this camera is the USB cable. It's not as long as I'd like it to be. It's only about uh, five, six foot, something like that. Uh, I'd like it to be a little bit longer, if possible. Um, which, well, I know it is because I'm certified in that. Um, basically, I'm gonna do a little walkthrough of the uh, software called iCreate via the uh, PlayStation 3 network. Uh, it's a free software you can just download. Um, well, here we go. What you're looking at now is the on screen, what it looks like to me. Whenever I'm doing this, you've got the uh, take a picture, video, and this camera has a built in microphone. You can use that. Then down here at the bottom, you have all the things you've done. Over here you have the number of clips you have currently right here and you have the percentage of 5 gigs. For some reason that's as big as it'll let you store in the in it and uh, I, that shows 88% free. Uh, the bad thing about this camera is the resolution. Uh, I'm not really sure what it is but um, a two minute video takes about 90 megabytes, which kind of sucks really. Um, I mean it's good for resolution, but not for memory space if you don't have a big hard drive or, or if you like making a lot of videos. Or if you upload them to the interweb, like YouTube or MySpace. Because those are real slow. Um, as you can see up here at the top, you have the navigate up and down d-pad uh, the pause button stop you can change your effects um, you can over here not sure how to get over there yet uh, hopefully I will eventually figure that out so things that right there little gears is the uh, settings and I'd like to get in there and find out what it's all about the uh, PlayStation I is currently $39.99 new and uh, if you can find one used at your local GameStop or someplace that sells used items uh, it's about $20 or so. I recommend just getting a new one because you don't know what the old one's been through. Uh, you know you can have a scratched up camera lens and the GameStop employee that checked it in didn't really look at it good or something anything uh, it's always good to buy new um, if you can afford it uh, another feature this camera has is a zoom it's only a one-way thing you can zoom in or zoom out that's it um, it does get a little you know small warm not really you know it just gets like a few degrees or whatnot um, the USB cable kind of controls where the camera is angled <laughs> As it is a stiff cable. Um, this is a basically a four-minute video. Uh, probably going to be about 150 megs.